welcome back to my youtube channel that is cat design master if you are new here please subscribe to this channel now this is time to learn more about the mold tools okay now in this tutorial i will explain you the draft analysis and its function uh, what is meant by the draft analysis okay so before draft analysis i want to show you some images over here you can see in this image this is the uh, wrong multi design that is uh, this is not selected this is right okay now what is mean by uh, if we drag this mold like in direction that is upward direction you can see uh, and this is the our final part okay this is our final part and this is the mold okay uh, mold action uh, this is the direction of the uh, upward end. okay now if we if we hold in pull this uh, in direction then the this mold will what will crack so this design will be rejected this is not uh, required required design okay i'm making it wrong okay this is not required design um so we provide the some draft angle over here okay i'm just uh, you can see this track in this angle has been made over here to this call is the drag angle okay this angle theta is called as the what drag angle draft angle sorry not track this is draft angle okay by watching uh, by applying the drive drag draft angle you can see the our mold will be easily removed from this and there is a no cracking will occur so this angle is called as the drag angle or also called as clearance angle clearance angle okay clearance angle. so there is a um, if a, a cracking occur so we analyze our part then this analysis is called as a draft analysis so in mold tools uh, one feature is called as the draft analysis now in this tutorial i will explain you so let's start click on draft analysis uh, for solidworks say to select the pull direction of the pull mm, means uh, what uh, what is the direction of you that is uh, in this case the direction of pulling is, is this direction that is upward so uh, in this uh, tutorial that is in this part I will drop it this part in okay perpendicular to right plane okay now you will see the analysis has been created uh, if we go any phase it will it will show you the track angle that is 0, 0.0 degree over here here is a 90 degree here at the fillet that is the 61.20 at this uh, hole that is 24.03 etc etc okay now uh, that is the drag angle is here so uh, as i explained you what is the drag angle and clearance angle is also called as a clearance angle what is the clearance angle so this angle is here that is three degree if we increase uh, it, it depend on our requirement that is basically three degree is enough for uh, drag analysis so there is a option that is adjacent trial what is mean by the adjacent trial uh, just uh, like before i had select the right plane to drag this uh, uh, to analyze this track uh, this part okay draft analysis so this is the adjustment side you can clarify or check our optimum and uh, the plane which we require okay so what is meant by the adjacent option it is used when more faces are present and you trying to optimum plane or best plane which separating the mold okay which plane is best for separating this mold okay but uh, default i had uh, selected the right plane but uh, now you can see this plane this blue plane is our our uh, mold plane or separating plane okay now you can see the our mold will go is uh, will pull in this direction okay in that direction now you can see what happened in the draft analysis now there is a very much chance to crack our part so i will just unclick this and uh, clicking on right and just uh, clear the section and reselect the right plane okay now our default value or selected right plane has been selected now second one is uh, in this that is uh, that is color selecting there are the three type of the trap that is positive requires and negative trap okay if we see there is a positive trap that is uh, means it uh, will not uh, any crack requirement or uh, there is no crack over here that is uh, where the green face is present there is no 
draft wing will have come or you can say that positive draft will uh, present okay now in this case that is negative draft the here the cracking chance is more and this is required draft means in here we require the drafting angle okay mm, in generally basically uh, if we analyze by your thinking then you can uh, you can think that uh, if we remove this part in uh, perpendicular to the right plane which I have, we have selected then the this edge this faces will maybe crack or uh, maybe damage to our mold okay because the, there is a much much more time and uh, very high uh, ability required to um, made uh, this mold so this is very re required and in company or industry there are the uh, n number of molds and uh, designing will be uh, present and, and require much more time and skills also so this phase may be correct so uh, solidworks say as this this phase should be uh, drafted okay or you can say the drafted phase or requires draft in now second is phase classification in phase classification solidworks will automatically find out the phase classification that is what are the positive draft phase what are how much required draft phase and negative draft and uh, straight draft what is mean by the straighter draft straighter draft are the phases which have positive and as well as negative and zero draft in this case there is a hole over here there is total four phases if we hide the if, if we want to show only this straddle phase you can uncheck this i and you can see only we have the four phases that is first first second third and fourth four phases are here which are the straddle phase that is mean that it has the negative positive and zero draft and uh, uh, okay so uh, now third option is find steep phase this option will only enable or activate when we select the phase classification you can see if i will uncheck this phase classification the third option will be inactive okay for this i have selecting the phase classification by clicking on the find steep phases you will see we have another op uh, option that is uh, steep phases and uh, negative steep phases uh, so i am just to show all the draft phases okay now here we can see the negative slip phases what is mean by the negative slip phases the slip phases the phases which come in between okay in between means uh, uh, if there is a uh, this is a um, phase which is going to be uh, perpendicular in one direction okay if there is any curve that is here uh, fillet has been made it so this phase is called as the steep phases now here is also uh, if this is uh, perpendicular uh, complete perpendicular there is only one phase so there is uh, here at the place of the fillet and the chamfer the steep faces are generated basically okay uh, this is nothing but all about the draft analysis okay now uh, if you see if uh, we uncheck the draft analysis the table has going to be inactive or unhead just click on draft analysis so there is uh, I think if you much more understood about the draft analysis, that is the mold tools. In previous chapter tutorial, I had explained you all about the weldments, sheet metal, surfaces, features. Okay, if you have not watched and you want to watch, you want to learn, you can go and watch all the tutorials in English. I will make the tutorials in Hindi also. Just please comment me in comment box. Okay, now in next tutorial, I will inshallah explain you the undercut analysis parting line analysis now i want to also uh, explain you the planar surface rule surface field surface offset surface radar surface and near surface this all surface we had uh, covered in the surface and sheet metal okay you can see field surface is also present in here rule surface offset surface and planar surface this is the same option in the mold tool so there is no requirement to um, and analyze you if you want this to do, of that tutorial uh, that all tutorial are in the description okay so thank you for watching